The death of a man who had been held at the Broome County Jail has some protesters demanding answers. Rob Carr died shortly after being in custody. He was in the jail as a result of failing to appear at a drug court session. Truth Farm Executive Director Alexis Plus says Card, who had a brain tumor, was denied his medication that prevented seizures, resulting in his health deteriorating behind bars. She says after 13 days in custody, he was released on Sunday, January 20th, after being physically unable to appear in court, then taken to the hospital and pronounced dead two days later. Plu says there needs to be more oversight and transparency for the jail, and she's calling for an outside investigation to determine what happened to Card while he was incarcerated. Imagine going to jail for a misdemeanor and in 13 days being dead just from being in jail for a misdemeanor. It's not like he was a big violent criminal. It was a misdemeanor and he's dead because of it and it was our Broome County Jail's fault. Broome County Sheriff David Harder says that Card was not denied his medication. He says that Card went through the protocol all inmates do when being processed which includes a health screening to determine what, if any, medications are required. Harder says there's nothing that the jail staff did that played a role in Card's death. I mean, these people have nothing else to do but make up stories. They have no idea what's going on. They just love to create, we'll say, headlines by saying he was murdered. No, he was murdered in jail. Truth Farm held a protest outside the county office building and also during the county legislature's monthly meeting yesterday. Pluse says the focus for people with substance abuse disorder should be shifted from incarceration to treatment.